Hey art friends, welcome to today's how-to. Today I'll be teaching you how to draw a super size in Goku. So first we're going to start over on the right side. We're going to start by drawing a small diagonal line that comes down. We're going to move over to the left and do the same thing. From here now on the bottom, we're going to arch a line that comes out towards the right. And we're going to move over to the left and do that one more time. Now from here, we're going to start in the corner and we're going to arch our line up towards the right and then we're going to bring it back down on a diagonal. We're going to move over to the left and do the same thing. So we're going to arch this all the way up and then we're going to bring this back down. Moving in towards the bottom now, we're going to draw a half circle for the right eye. And then we're going to move over to our left side and do that one more time. Now as we come in towards the middle, we're going to start at the top and draw another small half circle for the highlight of the eye. Moving over to that left side, doing that one more time. Now coming back around this, we're going to draw another half circle just a little bit bigger and bringing it up towards the top. And then we're going to move over to the left and we're going to do this one more time. Now as we come into the middle, we're going to draw the nose. So we're going to start by drawing a line that comes down in the center. We're going to draw a line that comes out towards the left and then back in on a diagonal. And then from here, we're just going to draw a straight line across and then we're gonna arch it back up. We're gonna drop directly down in the middle. We're going to draw an arch line that arches up. And now over on this left side, we're going to draw in the face. So over on the left, right in the middle where the eye is, we're gonna curve our line out. And we're gonna bring it in towards the middle. We're gonna step over to our right side lining this up at the same height. And we're going to do this again one more time as we come down, bringing it in towards the middle. Now from here, we're going to draw in the hair. So starting over on the right side, we're going to arch a line that comes down towards the bottom. Now we're gonna arch this up and over on the left side and we're gonna bring this all the way around and then down. Now on this right side, we're gonna continue on this line and arching it in towards our hair strand in the center. And then we're going to curve this back up towards the top. Moving over to the left side, we're gonna arch our line out and then down. And then from here, we're just going to arch our line back over and in towards the middle. We're going to move over to the right side and we're gonna do that again. So we're gonna arch this out, down, bring it in towards the side of the head. And then from here, we're gonna arch this up and back in towards the middle. Stepping over on this right side, I'm going to draw a half circle for the right ear. And then moving over to the left side, we're just going to draw another circle for our left ear. Moving underneath the eye on the right side, we're going to draw an arch line that comes out towards the right. And then moving over to the left, we're going to do that again one more time. Now coming up towards the top, we're going to start by arching a line that comes up and then out, curving it up towards the top. We're gonna arch this back down on the right, and then we're gonna curve this back in towards the middle. We're going to move back over on the right, arching this line up, and then from here, we're just gonna arch this line back down and then in towards the side. We're gonna move back over to the right, drawing a line that comes out very small, and then we're gonna arch this back in towards the side one more time. From here now, we're going to arch a line that comes out towards the right, and we're gonna bring it back in. And then one last time, we're gonna curve this out and then bring it back in towards the side of the head. Moving over to the left, we're gonna arch our line up towards the top. Now moving over to the left, we're gonna bring this out and then down. We're gonna come behind this, arching our line up towards the top. We're gonna to bring this back down on the left side, arching it in. Now dropping a little bit lower, we're going to arch our line all the way over to the left, bring it back in on the side. We're going to draw a curved line that comes in towards our ear. And then we're going to come out one more time with a small triangle and bring it back in on the left side on the ear. We're going to come back up over on this side now. We're going to curve our line out towards the left. And then we're just going to curve this line back in towards that strand. Now we're going to frame in the torso. So we're going to come underneath. We're going to draw a curved line right underneath. We're going to move over to the left curving our line out. We're going to move over to the right, doing the same thing for the shoulder. 
You're gonna start back on that line, arching it in and then back down. Moving over to the right side, we're going to arch this in and then back down. Now in the middle, we're going to draw a small rectangle shape. And then on this left side, we're going to bring our line out and then down. We're gonna start at that point there, arching it over, and then we're gonna bring it back up. We're gonna move over to the right, arching this down. We're going to bring a diagonal line that comes up towards the top. And then we're gonna bring this back up and in towards the middle. Now over on this left side, we're going to arch our line that comes in towards the middle. We're gonna start back on that line, arching it out and then down. We're gonna move in towards the right, curving that line in. And then we're going to close this off with a curved line. We're going to step up a little bit higher, do this one more time. Now inside of here, we're going to start by drawing a curved line in the middle. We're gonna start by bringing our line out and then back up towards the top. We're gonna to start back on this line, bring our line down on a diagonal over towards the left. And then we're gonna bring this over towards the left and all the way up towards the top. We're going to come over to the right. We're going to arch our line in. We're gonna come over to the left, do the same thing. Now from here, we're gonna curve this line out and then down. And then on the inside, we're going to do that one more time. Again, we're going to close this off with a curved line. We're gonna step up a little bit higher and do the same thing. Dropping a little bit lower now, we're going to draw another curved line. And then we're going to bring our line out towards the left, arching it back up towards the top. We're going to start back on the bottom, arching it down, bring it all the way across and then back up towards the side. And then now from here on the right, we're going to curve a line that comes up we're going to do that one more time. As we come back in towards the middle, we're going to draw a line that comes directly across towards the right. On this right side now, where we have this right line, we're going to curve this line down towards the bottom and then we're gonna arch it back out and then in. We're going to move over to the left, arching it past our hand and then in. From the inside here, we're going to curve our line in towards the left, do the same thing on the right. And then now we're going to arch this back out to the right and then in, out to the left and then in. We're gonna move back up to the top and we're going to draw a curved line that comes across to the right. We're going to move over to the left and do that one more time. And then now from here, we're going to close these off with two curved lines on the left and right side. Moving in towards the bottom now, we're going to arch our line down towards the bottom of the page, doing the same thing on the left. Moving over towards this left side, I'm going to bring my line out and then we're gonna just bring it out and then down. And then we're gonna move over to the right, arching it out and then down. And then now we're going to close this right foot off with a curved line. And we're going to do the same thing on the left. We're going to move up directly in the middle of both and we're going to draw a curved line, dropping a little bit lower, doing the same thing. We're going to do the same thing on the left. Moving in towards the top now, we're going to curve a line that comes in towards the center on both sides. And then from there, we're gonna bring a line that comes down directly in the middle. We're going to follow this line through towards the bottom. And then now from here, we're going to draw another curve line that comes out towards the left and then out towards the right. We're going to move over towards the left side now. We're going to bring our line all the way across and then we're gonna bring it back down. We're gonna bring this through down on the bottom, and then we're gonna close this off with another curved line coming out towards the right. And that is it, that's how you draw Super Saiyajin Goku. You guys can pause the video and color it the way that I have done, or you can change your colors up if you'd like. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. And also drop a comment below suggesting any more characters that you'd love to learn to draw next. Thanks so much for joining me on today's tutorial, and I'll see you guys on the next one.